Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide part 1, 2020. So, let's jump right into it. Now, according to www.breakingtravelnews.com, I have got nine fantastic brand new travel facts so let's fire away uh, with number one which is uh, rail and coach news which is first group sells greyhound facilities in north america first group has sold three major bo uh, bus facilities in north america for a total of 102 million uh, dollars at uh, the firm as said, the move was part of the continued drive to rationalise its bus, bus property portfolio. So, um, hopefully uh, they'll buy more buses in the future, hopefully, fingers crossed. And obviously need to cut, uh, cut their losses at the moment but hopefully in the future they'll um, buy more buses and coaches and trains in the future fingers crossed number two commercial aviation fatalities um, increase in 2020 that's the latest airline news Unfortunately, new research has revealed that more people died in commercial plane uh, crashes uh, last year in two th than in 2019. Um, this one despite the number of flights plummeting due to the pandemic. Um, so again, that's very unfortunate. Um, again, hopefully this year. Um, there'll be not so many uh, plane crashes or fatalities fingers crossed on the up, um, up british airways it secures a two million in export development loans which is really good news uh, for the airline company that um, the latest airline news the airline has received um, commitments uh, for about five year term loan export development guarantee facilities the level the foot sorry the funds are underwritten by a syndicate of banks uh, partially guaranteed by the UK export finance so again that's uh, good news for british airways hope um it's going to be a better year and um, this year for um all businesses and uh, iag rejigs ownership structure to accommodate brexit so so IGA are just um, rejuggling the ownership at structure. Um, so hopefully that'll be better for in the future. And number five, Robbie launches new tours across the UK and Ireland. So, oh, I'll have to check that out and um, tell you more about that um, in the future, just say. Um, and again, good luck uh, to the travel company. And number six, Qatar Airways to launch Seattle route uh, this month. So I hope that goes well for Seattle and Qatar Airways and uh, number seven uh, dominican republic extends covid19 healthcare offer so that's really good news um if you're traveling to the dominican republic and uh, number eight um 
um, continent uh, return to Britain if ferries to ease Brexit transition. So that's really good news. Hope it goes well for both con uh, companies in the future. And last but not least, Abita uh, places member at heart of a new travel with confidence campaign so i hope that's going to be really good news well it sounds like it and um, i hope it's really good news for customers and um, abita so i would like to say thank you for watching um please press uh, press the red and white subscription button also click the notification bell I'm looking to uh, get up to 2,000 subscribers as soon as possible. So please keep those subscriptions coming in. It really means a lot to me. And um, I would like to say thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow uh, with another travel vlog at 6.30. And everybody take care and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.